In this video, I'm going to show you how to put your Google Slides for your math notebook into your Schoology so that students can complete the slides. So first, you're going to need to open up your slides. And inside of here, you'll notice that the backgrounds for everything are pictures, except for the things that students will complete. So everything will be in this like light blue, so where they can drag the commas. If they need to drag a circle to an answer, they can drag the circle to their answer. Or if they need to type things, they can type things inside of text boxes. So that's kind of what they will do on their slides once it's assigned to them. But in order to assign it, you need to go to your Schoology account and you're going to wait till you have this little plus sign or you can press add materials. We're going to add an assignment so that we're able to make a copy for each student and you can put a grade to it if you want to or you can use it as a formative assessment. Then you can type in the name of your assignment. So for this, this was lesson 1A and it'll be the basics of place value lesson. You can add a description if you want to remind students of certain expectations. And then to add a copy for each student, we're going to press the Google Drive assignments. If you haven't already added the Google Drive app to your Schoology, you're going to need to do that first. If we don't know where it is, we can search a Google Drive for it. Then we attach it and it says this will create a copy of your file for each student. So we know that every student will be able to complete the assignment. We can add a due date if we want it done by a certain time. We can add a point value. We can change the category to classwork if you're just doing it for classwork. You can change the grading period, the factor, numbers. You can align it to learning objectives. You can individually assign it to students. You can publish it to the students right away or not have it published right away. There's so many things that you can do. And when you are happy with what you've chosen, you can press create. And then in your Schoology, you'll see that the lesson will be right here. So students will be able to open that up and access their assignment. And you will be able to see the students that are still in progress and the students that have submitted their work. I hope that you learned about how to assign your Google Slides to students in Schoology. This is Bright Spots Teaching.